Welcome back to Daisy. Unsurprisingly, I have found a gun here in, in this barrack. I'm pretty sure this is how one of these videos has begun before now. Starting here in Svetlo before. But we are back on the project. And today is wipe day. And it is going to be a very special wipe indeed. Oh, a key coin. Nice. Funny, good loot. The server has just restarted. I'm a few hours after wipe, but I have managed to get in just after the restart there. So I might be able to get some good loot still. I'm not really 100% sure. But us finding a gun, AR-15 MD, is not a bad start. I've got a sight for it going as well. This is a modded server, as you guys can tell, as I've got a gun straight away. I am playing solo, and it is a clan-infested server. So it's never easy when you're trying to get one of these businesses off the ground. And my general plan of attack is always to set up a base first and foremost. However, in order to build the base, I do need a little bit of money. One of the easiest ways of doing so on this server is through keys. However, there is a lot of updates that have gone on from 1.23 and the project admins have done bits and also updated their servers a lot. Looks like there's a whole new 3D printing set up as well, so we are bringing back the 3D printing empire. But this time, I think it should be even bigger and better than the last time. I might just go down here and see if there's any more loot for this military stuff, since it was pretty good stuff before. Uh, there's a plank pile there, could be useful. Of course, zombies, I'm going to kill them, but there's, uh, there's keys in that for me. Keys or food. Evil one is pretty good. Shouts out to the taxi business down there at the end of the dock, if uh, any of you guys remember that. Okay, it's time to spread our wings and fly. We are going to go down this way, down the tracks. If I keep doing this, I will get a key. Okay, an IFAC's good though, an IFAC's decent. Still no key. Wow, not a single key on all of those. I wonder if they've nerfed the key drop rates. That could be interesting to find out. Okay, well, a long way to go. We're generally speaking going to be running towards the cliff trader. I want to set my base up up north because I'm going to be doing a lot of running. Air gloves. Uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of running to the black market trader. It's what you end up doing as a 3D printing business because you need to go there all the time to make profit. So having a base close to there would be pretty useful. Something close to there in the cliff trader is probably ideal. Ah, uh, no. Box of small rounds, though. Oh, the key room locations have changed. That will definitely uh, make things interesting. What we got? Nice. A tactical sling pack. That's a great little find. Gives me loads of room to pick up all the extra shit that I'm going to need. We're off to a flying start now, guys. Got these trains up here. I might check real quick. These normally give some good loot. Oh, there you go, see? Straight away, filament, mid-tier metal. That's huge. That's huge. And that is one of the new 3D printing items I'm talking about. So I don't really know it all inside out just yet, but that's definitely one of them. And that's really great to find already. we got more zombies over here. Damn it, I'm getting no keys from him though. Used to be that you always got the keys. Now, not so much by the looks of it. Jerry can. It's useful. Alright then, and we're heading out of Svet. Pretty decent start. Gotta check out the Tarovo military, of course. Up here. And then, uh, I guess we'll head through into Novod. I could actually even go up through the north and loot the towns up there. Might be better off than going through Novod. Another little gun there, another little gun. And another gun here as well. MK18, that's decent. That's decent right there. Okay, no mag for it, of course. 
Gonna have to work up to that, but that's a good gun to find straight away. What we got up here? Another gun up here too, yeah. MTAR. Okay, I think we'll uh, just stick on the main road. Let's go up into Novod this way. Just send it straight through. I know you got the little town there, but uh, you never find anything. Well, not never, but you might not find anything. And Novod's probably better a chance of finding something and finding someone to fight. Ah, see, so Happy Kilmore's just said in the chat, where do you sell pelts? Which is another thing that's been added now, is pelts into the game, so... Could even set up a little hunting stand if you wanted to and just farm up some pelts, try and make some money that way. I don't think it'll be as good money as 3D printing, but there won't be quite as much risk involved because you probably only need to go to the trader. You don't need to go into the black market, I would imagine, which is, you know, the most risky part. Here we are, we've got Novod Industrial to loot through. This is going to be worth it, I would imagine. Really hoping for some building materials. Okay, there's quite a decent little few spots, actually, I can build in here. If I want to be close between uh, between Black Market and Cliff Trader, which I think is where I want to be. You know, it's been so many videos now since I died at some point and lost all my progress and had to start again, too, so... You never know, one of those could be coming as well. Right, I'm just going to start right at the back of this area and push my way through, try and loot as much of it as I possibly can. Hopefully I can pick up some filaments and that sort of thing. Oh, a power generator. That's ridiculously good because I really need that. It just fits in my bag. Okay, I'm going to have to start dropping stuff to carry this. I'm getting so, like, the luck I'm getting for, for the specific 3D printing business that I want to do. Gonna have to leave most of this food and these mags and stuff. That's like 200k, that power generator. That's really expensive. This is why I said we should loot up Novod. I knew it'd be like this. Okay. Camo net too. Oh, there's gonna be some loot in here. I can tell already. I really need, gonna need to be careful. Combing through everything, looting, make sure I get what I need. Power generator isn't crazy loot. I don't think I've ever found one of those on this server. Okay, what started as a really promising Novod run has dried up a little bit, I'll be honest. A hacksaw's not bad. Uh, actually, I could just leave it again. I don't really need tools right now. Tools are fairly cheap to buy. Okay, pants is good, because this will give me a bit more storage space. Got Charizard charm. Goodfellas DVD, or VHS. And, oh, I, I've actually got uh, a magazine for this. Pistol, funnily enough. Can't equip it right now, but that'd be worth hanging on to. Could be good for taking out zombies. What was that? Some rounds. Which is good, because that's what my other gun takes, which I just don't have a mag for quite yet. But I will do, eventually. And also, the 7.62x5.4 has been buffed on the server now, compared to 308. So 7.62x5.4 is actually better than 308 now on the server. Okay, up at the next part of Novod. See, this stuff here is a bit nearer to the trader, so I don't think uh, it's much less likely to have loot. Okay, I'm nearly through the whole of Novod now. Just been pumping it through, trying to grab as much as I can. This all seems kind of looted here. I'm right next to the trader. Yeah, it's literally just up the hill, so. Right, last couple little scraps of loot. Unfortunately, not got a single key, which is what I was really after. So I might just have to keep up with looting after this. We just gotta head up the hill here and we're there. There we go. Enter the safe zone. I mean, it's te definitely not a terrible start with getting the uh, mid-tier metal filament, which is, like I said, this is new. It did used to, used to be red and blue, and now it looks like there's more, so we're gonna have to work it out little by little. Okay, I'm gonna need to be a little bit smart here. I think they were putting the peer-to-peer -peer back in, so let's go to Altar and see if they have because if they did, I think listing the power generator for now is a good idea. Let me sell my guns quick. If you guys saw the last series, then you'll know what strat I'm about to employ. But you can basically list stuff for sale, and if people don't buy it, then you can get it back afterwards. So, it means I can list this and it probably won't go anywhere. Okay, I'm going to sell my other guns I've got, because these guns all kind of suck. MK... 18. It's uh, not guns I want, it's mags. <laughs> MK. 18, dual mag. Okay, for a... We'll just go for a standard little small mag. I don't really think I need a huge mag. 
Oh, that's 308 now. Okay, so they've actually changed it, unless that was always 308. Okay, that's annoying, because now I need to buy 308 rounds. Ammunition, mid-tier, low-tier, 308 rounds. Here you go. 30. Right, okay, that's the best I'm going to do for a minute. Let's go over to this peer-to-peer -peer trader. Make sure it's all back running again. Oh, see, now it won't load up. Okay, maybe I've got the wrong rounds for this. Well, I've definitely got the wrong rounds for it, but I don't know what they are. It might just be the 300 blackout. Let me try these and then we'll, we'll know for sure, won't we? Okay, and that didn't work either. So, none of the rounds work with these. With this mag, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, I'm just trying to see if there's anything anything else I could potentially do, but no, that's, that's it, guys. Well, I'm just going to sell it then, I guess. We'll keep the ammo in case I need it, but I'm just going to get rid of the gun because I can't even load the mag. I'm stuck with a pistol for the meantime. <laughs> Damn. I wish I didn't sell the other one now. It's okay, the, the pistol's okay, the pistol's okay. 20 round mag, I mean, that's, that's good. And I need to see how much money I've got. We should have 50k in the ATM. Waiting for us. Yep. Get that little bit of starting money, it always helps. And yeah, the peer-to-peer -peer trader is back, which is good to see. I did miss it. And oh my, we've got some really cheap filament on here, okay. I'll take this blue filament for 50k. That's really cheap. I've got to. Even if I can't cash that in yet, that's just so cheap. It's like not even worth thinking about. Oh, there's keys on here cheap as well. Maybe I shouldn't have bought that. Okay, well, I mean, it's not much. Yeah, I'm going to have to just sort of go keep going about. I'm going to buy like a bit more storage for myself. Combat belt. That's better so I can have a bit of storage on there. The armor, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it costs way too much for me to buy. Preferably not going to be running around with this stuff, but I think I might have to. Unless I just drop it somewhere. Okay, let's go to Kamensk then. Probably a good idea. Or well, maybe not a good idea, but it's probably my only idea that I've got. I'm going to run up here. I'm going to stash because I'm definitely not taking my good stuff in. I can stash it just outside the cliff trader, so it's not too bad. Or I can stash it inside the cliff trader, to be honest. Oh, we are leaving the safe zone. Okay. To find somewhere to stash up here then. Yeah, this will definitely do. Okay, so we'll drop that, 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 and that. And that. Oh, and my money. I've got money on me. Whoops. It's only like a few things. It's not a lot, but it's uh, just a lot of big things, basically. There we go. That's looking good now. Let me put a marker down so I don't lose my stuff. Okay. And we carry on. Now we're risk-free, which is good, considering I've only got a pistol. <laughs> Wait a second. I just realized I don't have that blue filament. Oh, what a dildo. I messed up. Going back, hopefully it'll be on the floor. Definitely didn't have a blue filament in with this stuff, did I? No. Hopefully it's on the floor still. Oh, it's literally on the floor. No one's grabbed it. Absolute G's. Absolute G's. If you were one of the people that saw this and didn't steal it, you're a legend. Thank you. Right, we got our filament, boys. We're on with the mission. Go on with the mission. Okay. There we go. Our blue filament is back where it belongs. With our other stuff. Okay, I do sort of just need to loot. I, I don't have uh, any value on me now, so if I die, it's no problem at all. I can just run back, I can get my important stuff. But really now I need to be finding some good loot, so I can't be scared. I need to just fearlessly loot everything. And hopefully get a good pull. Which is rare, I know. Tell you what, we've not seen any bases yet, have we? Not seen anyone setting anything up or anything. Maybe it's because we're up north, it's just a bit quiet, I don't know. I'm feeling north this wipe though, I'm enjoying it up here, I like it. Nah, there's nothing here, I think I'm better off just running through. Oh wow, someone's based up already in there. Just as I was saying, about no bases. Someone has a base. Oh my god, he's there. Well, let's try to sneak up on him. Nothing to lose. Oh, I killed him, I killed him, I killed him. We traded. The joys of having no armor, eh? Trying to get a quick spawn here. Cliff safe zone, I'm gonna I'm running. Okay, I might be able to get back to him quick, quick, quick here and get some loot. I don't know, it's worth a try. Okay, okay, this is good, this is good. I might be able to get some loot there, guys. Unless he's got a teammate there. If he's got a teammate there, I'm screwed. Okay, well, it didn't take us long to find our first bit of action. He's right behind me. They say it's on like Donkey Kong, I think it would be an understatement. 
need to get his gun to my hands because it was better than mine. Damn, I lost time there. Got that first. Wow. He went down, he went down. I got him, I got him. Oh. <laughs> that was so intense. He got my gun from the first time, and I got his gun. Why would he get my gun when I just had like a spray? Oh, okay. Let me check what he had. He didn't have anything on him. Just like I didn't either. Oh, oh well, we came out on top. That's what matters. Okay, yeah, I think all the guns are out of ammo. That's not great. Shit, <laughs> <laughs> now, <laughs> Mr. Krabs got me from miles away. Yeah, oh yeah, I didn't have any bullets left, man. Ah, uh, okay. What well, is annoying, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, let's go south. I'm gonna go to Svergino because I need to try and get a gun. I need to get to one of the militaries or something. That was so funny. <laughs> that fight with that river dog, I just sprayed him down with that gun. It had so many bullets, thank God, because it was so inaccurate. And I was just spraying, praying. Oh, okay. So that shows why we need a plate carrier real bad. Oh, we got the new Northwest. Look at this. Damn. I mean, this is going to be interesting to go and check out. We're going to have to get to Northwest at some point or rather. But will that be in this video? I don't know. Okay, it looks like there's loot here in this town. Whether it's just that first building there, you never know. Let's see. Paycheck, baby. I actually really need that paycheck right now because I'm skint. Or broke, as the Americans say. There's people just begging for guns in the chat. Maybe I should do that. Oh, no way. A 3D printer kit, guys. Okay, I've got to take that to the stash. Another hatchet, too. Like, I've got building materials. I've got quite a lot of stuff for a base now. We're, we're getting there, man. A gun, too. Terrible gun, but a gun nonetheless. A BK-18. This will actually get the job done. No one have an armor on, so it's actually good. Toy Story VHS, too. Okay, back up to the stash real quick, and then we'll loot the rest of the town. It's only 700 away. Bro, so I've got the printer. I've got the power generator. I've got gasoline to put in it, which I know doesn't sound like a big deal, but the gasoline's normally hard to get. But that's a pretty rare find. And I've got two filaments already. Oh my god, and a code lock too. What is going on, man? I'm getting such good loot. I am a bit nervous about where the stash is since it's just outside a safe zone. And with it getting bigger and bigger like this, like, this is a bit risky. So maybe I should go in. I don't know how I can make any money. I need to make some money somehow. Oh, screw it. You know what? We'll just drop this stuff off here. It'll be fine. Because no one's here right now. And then we'll just grab these both on the way through. Because I really want to loot the rest of the town. This town has not been touched. Like, and I only went for a few buildings there. There's a real potential to get a lot of stuff now. Okay, I mean, a splitting axe is decent as well, because I'm going to be chopping down as well, so I'm literally just finding a series of everything that I need right now. Ooh. The Enfield. What does that take? 308. Okay, I don't have any on me, but that's good. Okay, so, the first run, I got really good stuff, and I've got my hopes up loads, and then now I've come back and I've found absolutely nothing. Another axe. What's that? What, N64? Nice. More sellables. Oh my god, more sellables. Okay, we gotta get rid of that. Well, this is good. A, a bag, finally. Same bag that I had before. That will help me carry the rest of the stuff out. Because I got a lot of it. Whoa. Rope's low-key good, because I could make a base anywhere I want now. 
Ah, oh, there you go. Tier 2 key. You gotta let me put these pants on. I got my stuff. Where is it? Tier 2. This opens a tier 2 locked door. Okay, so we don't know where they are yet. I'll need to look that up. On a smash vest as well. Let me carry some more stuff. Sweet. Tier 2 key is good. I think uh, that's a pretty good cue to head back to the stash. Wow, Cuban Link bracelet as well. More sellable stuff. It's going to have to be a black market run, but I don't have a gun, so I can't go yet. Oh my god, a box of nails. That's literally everything I need for a base. I sort of need two boxes of nails. Unless I just build in one of these buildings here. Which I'm really tempted to do right now. This shed here I've built in before. I've used this as a st oh, and a saw too. Okay, let me go back up to my stash. I need to go back up to my stashes and consolidate my stuff. And seriously think about this, because I could really build a base right now. I couldn't build a freestanding base, but I could just put a door in somewhere, which is a good option. I always start by building a freestanding base, and it's really rough. It's, it's a whole building process, whereas if I just do this, it's one door to build. It's easy as hell. I can focus more on the printing side of things, and then maybe in the next video, we'll set up a whole custom, you know, 3D printing office. Maybe we've got to work our way up to the office a little bit, you know. It does cost a little bit of money. And I don't really want to do too much money through looting and stuff on this. I do sort of want to do as much of it as I can through the 3D printing. See how much money we can actually make through it, you know? This is going to take me quite a while to sort all this stuff out. I'm going to have to go back and forth to Trader a couple of times, I think. Let me check this stuff here. Right, okay, let me drop this stuff. I'll go and get the other stuff from up there. And bring it down here, where it's safer because it's a bit further away from Trader, and then I think I can probably just build a base right now, so I'm going to do it. Just get a door down somewhere. And then I can put, like, my 3D printer and all this stuff away, because I've got way too much stuff on me right now. I don't even have a gun, man. I could also just get logs in the woods. Well, let me get this uh, thing and transport it down, and then we'll get logs really quick. Okay, let's see if my stuff got stolen. Oh, it did. Wow. It actually did. They took my filaments. Ah, oh, mother f man. Got, got robbed. See, that's why I didn't want to leave it too long. Well, I mean, I've still got the power generator and gasoline, which is the main things that I really wanted from that stash, but it had the filaments, which obviously I could have printed with straight away. That's annoying, man. It got stolen. Not sure what else was there. There was a few goodies there. Nothing amazing. But the, yeah, the main thing was the filaments. Dump this here. For now. Let me put this key down up with this stuff as well. And let me get a little sit rep of my stuff. Work out what I need to build. Gonna need some sticks and a rope. Let's do flagpole first. Let's get a base up because I'm not having them uh, rob my stash again. Oh wait, there's one thing I don't have which is a, a crafting notebook thing. I'm gonna have to run to the trader and get one. Can't make the kits otherwise. Okay, I'm taking all the good stuff and I'm running. Back to the trader. Okay, I'm in the safe zone so I can jump off the cliffs. Whee! And we need to buy the base building book. I'm pretty sure that's all we need. And I'm good glad that's all we need because that's all the money I've got as well by the looks of it. base. That's 2.5k for that. At uh, 1.5k for the, or 1k for the workbench kit. I'll get one of those then too. Repaint workbench. 1 million! Damn! Okay, there's sharpening stones to buy, but honestly I don't even need sharpening stone. Because I'm not going to be building that much. I'm going to build one door. I was looking at that mustache that was just up the road. I think that would be perfect. Okay, I don't have any money to buy a gun, but I might be able to buy some rounds for this Lee Enfield, which is probably better actually. Let me see, because that would just be some 308 rounds. Okay, spent all my money on 308. That's all I got. Okay, I literally just need to do this and get like a stack of planks on the way through. And if I make it in one piece, then I'm an absolute legend. Literally got everything to build. Let's go. Let's go, we got a chance. We got a chance at a base. What I want to do is get out towards this second stash marker where it's sort of safe. Sure no one's following me right now, which I don't think they are. 
Yeah, once I'm out of the safe zone over here in the woods, it's, it seems kind of safe to cut down a few. Uh, I can cut down like single logs. Uh, all I need is a stack of like 20 planks. I left the safe zone. Okay, I'm going for this now. That's two. Three. And four. Stop here for a second. Saw in hands. Okay, one more and then we got a full stack of... This will give us the full stack of 20. Okay, let's go. That's enough to build the door. We've got my other stuff up here. Power generator and a gasoline tank, which we're going to have to come back for. Now, I like the look of the mustache that was up there at the top. I think that's probably better to be up the hill than down it. That one there. I think that's my base. Come on. Keep it together. Keep it together. This has been a pretty intense wipe day, to say the least. It's 1.35am, with no obvious end in sight. Could always just set up in the shed, but that doesn't seem quite so good for some reason. Okay, I'm in. Doors are all closed in here. This might have been the one building that I didn't actually loot. Okay, let's get this going. First thing I need to do is put the flagpole. Fish. <laughs> For some reason, my group name is always Fish. Don't worry, don't ask why. Even I don't know. Okay, flag's there, out of the way. Put this here. Book goes on it. Read. Door kit. Craft. Yes. It's not right. <laughs> I have to put it down a little bit. Wait, do you reckon I can just do the small door kit? I can just do the small. Right, I need to do this quick. Uh, that's going to have to do it. I can't get it quite right. Door frame. Door. Plank wall. Code lock. Boom. There we go. We're secure, guys. We're secure. Oh my god, that was an insane run. The amount of loot that I got and lost and died and started again with and... Oh my days. Okay, well I've got a little bit more storage outside that I can go and get. But now... Just gonna put everything down. Everything I'm keeping, I'll put in this one. Everything I'm selling will go in the floor. I'm gonna go run and grab these other bits of loot. Now it's important to get an airlock down, but door is a good start. See how that looks from this side. Yeah, that looks fine. Looks perfect. All right, let me go get my other bits. Okay, get my other bits, and then two doors is the goal. I'm gonna need another code lock for that, and obviously more planks and building stuff. So we'll get there eventually. <laughs> oh, sticking right out of the tree there, but we got it. Okay, that's one stash cleared. And my other bits are in this little bush down here. There we go. That's everything. There it is. The base. Proud and glorious. You know, it's been a while since I built on a mustache. It's been a long time. My first ever base was a mustache. The most easy and convenient base to build. I love it. Okay, think of door camps, that's good. Right, let me put this down. And we got another storage to put as well. Guy's lost his base already. Okay, now I have this bunch of sellables, which I could just take and go for a mad run to the black market trader and see if I get anything from it. It could be worth it, you know. It's not like it's loads of money's worth. And it's not like I've got any other choice really apart from doing this tier 2 key. Which is guaranteed going to be hot. Just because of it being wipe day, everyone will be doing keys. But equally, everyone will be going to the black market too, so I guess i just got to go for a lucky, a lucky punt at it if I want one. 
and I need to fortify this a little bit more as well. Let's go black market. Let's try and get a little bit of money. If I lose this stuff, I won't be too sad because it will mean that I don't have to go back to, back to the black market for a while. Ooh. Nice, okay. Another jacket with a blue key in as well, which is a tier one. Which will be another good uh, thing that I can go and do. We go and take that into the base. Okay, well I'm putting this key away. Now one thing I need for the 3D printing business is a cable reel. And the only place to buy it from a trader is here. At the black market where I'm going to, so... With the money that I get from this, if I'm able to sell without dying... Then I'll be able to get a cable reel and get the hell out of there and back to base. At which point, all I need is a spark plug. Uh, and I can get printing. Well, and some filament too, since my filament got stolen before. Got a little base just up here. Next to the school. Okay, so we've got a few bases being thrown up already. Oh, you got a base in those apartments up there as well. Yeah, Severo is a solid avoid right now, honestly. Maybe, yes, there is one. Yeah, there is. There might be people camping this if there is. Uh, there's not much I can do. I'm just going to charge in, you know. If I if I do get in a fight, I might be able to win it if it's a bit of a 50-50. But I don't want to waste too much time really slowly clearing this. I want to just get in and get out. The more time I'm here, honestly, the more chance someone else rocks up to sell their stuff. And they could be way more geared than me. Most likely are way more geared than me. I've got no plate carrier and a Lee Enfield. Well, we're nearly there, so let's do this thing. Okay, I'm just going to crouch on the initial approach. No one at that one. No one at that one, let's go. Okay, 170k I've got. Um, well my brain went completely blank. Cable reel. Anything else in the base I want? Okay. Cost me 100k, but I bought an armor. Wait, I want to go out this way. Yeah, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, let's go. Let's go, back to base. Nerve-wracking stuff. Yeah, 100,000 I had to put into that, but I got an armor, and that's just so worth it, honestly, guys. That's so worth it. A, a Gen 4 armor at this stage is decent. Someone's gonna need, like, a decent 308 or something to kill me. Or, you know, even, like, a 338. That makes me feel a lot better. I don't have a helmet, though, obviously, which is still not good. But I have 45,000 left to play with. Not bad. I just realised I don't even have a bandage, man. This could go horribly wrong. Sock on bag with a tier 1 key in. Huge. Starting to rack up on these keys now. Oh. Shit, this shot's just up there. Some nice shoes. Going towards those shots, man. Seen him. <laughs> two of them. They could be the ones living in that base, you know? Okay, I'm thinking that those two guys there coming out of that base must have been the two in the... in the, uh... Garage. What was there? I don't want to push that alone with, with my stuff on me though. So we either go up that way, around this way. Because my base is over there, which isn't great. I reckon they've gone in their base. I reckon I should just make a mad dash for it. Go in. I'm going to go across this way and past these apartments. Don't really feel great about passing these guys' base so close. But I am anyway. Oh, 
I'm in. Yes. <laughs> that was a stressful run, man. All for this cable reel. Ugh. Oh my god, I don't even know what to think right now. Okay, where's my 3D printer kit? Let's get this set up. Connect, plug in, connect. Uh, reposition. That'll do. Okay, so I need a spark plug still. But yeah, that's a pretty decent start right there. Uh, did I have any planks left from before? Yeah, I do have some planks left. Let me get some uh, blueprints up so I know exactly what I need to build. But yeah, I like that. That looks good. Like so. Right, there we go. Okay, we'll leave that for now because that will just leave uh, a couple of weaknesses outside. It's not too bad. Run up into the woods up here and get some. Okay, we're full. Didn't take long. It's much less stressful when you have a base to fall back into. Okay. Uh, let's get to soaring. Okay, that's all my planks. That's quite a lot as well. Okay, we'll start with doing the window downstairs. This is always like the most important bit is downstairs. Plank wall. Wooden hatch. There we go. Plank wall. Hopefully I have the materials to build all this stuff. Definitely got the planks. Ah oh, no, nails I'm a little short on. I can't quite build this one up the whole way by the looks of it. Yeah, we need a few more nails now. But that's a pretty good start right there. I want to just run outside quick and make sure that you definitely can't um, get through there. Yeah, so you can't open the window from the other side, so that's fine. Alright, we're all set up. I need to get my stuff to go to the trader. I'm going to take these keys because I'm going to list some of them for sale, I think. Yeah, it's looking nice in here, guys. It's looking really sick in there. I'm really happy with this. There's not a whole lot of money in what I've got, but I might try and sell some of these keys if I can. Okay, let's go to the altar trader. And once here... I'm going to sell these two guns. Okay, yeah, I've got 10k for them both. What's that on the floor then? Sniper bipod. I'm taking those, mate. They dropped them. They're worth loads of black market. Noobs. Okay, I mean, that's worth keeping. I can definitely make money on those at some point. Just for a little black market run. Filament, filament. Yeah, I mean, there's not really... There is cheap filament on here. Maybe I should just buy one of these. 45k is a real good price, and I can get printing something straight away then. Let's do that. Let's do it. Boom. We've got sniper bipods to do still. Oh, wait, I need to go up to the vehicle trader. So we can get the spark plug that we need. Okay. Glasses. There you go. We'll just take a standard pair of... MVGs, and I want to get some batteries as well. Okay, money's not looking great. We got 8,000. We need to get back to base. Sun's going down. So we will be able to spend our first night in the base, I think. Oh, I went to the wrong trader. Damn it. Old habits. Literally getting dark. I'm going to gather some firewood. Okay, we are heading back to base. We've got stuff in our bags. The ideal thing would be to get a 3D printer on straight away, but we're going to have to wait till the restart to do that. Right, the sun is literally almost completely down. I'm 200 meters out of base. I'm, I'm weirdly excited to get into base for night time. I don't know how I, I can explain it. I just, I know I'm going to be safe and cozy. I can put the fire on. Oh, which reminds me, I need to get some 
Barks. If I don't get bark now, I'll be screwed. I need sticks too. Get them G's on so I can actually see. Make sure there's no one in there. Yeah. We're good. And we're in. Safe and sound in the base. Now, I want to get this fire going. I don't know if a fire has ever been put on on this server, but it will be now. And drill kit. Alright, here we go. Fire's going on, guys. Look at this. Oh, <laughs> Wow. I mean, that's just so satisfying to see, isn't it? That is just a great sight. The fire's on in base. We're all nice and cozy. And we've got 3D printing ability now as well. Let me get some gasoline to fill this up. But I can't put it on just yet because if I do, it will be a grave error. Because you can't have the thing on while the restart's going. But if I just switch on, I can show you guys real quick. This is sort of how the interface looks. Uh, we can actually toggle the tray and we'll open up the disc tray there, let you see. And put that filament in and close it back down. And then we can see the new stuff that I can build. Oh, I can make guns. Oh, so I could have made a timber wolf with that, what I had earlier. That metal, uh, mid-tier metal filament. Okay. You can make suppressors with that. NBC respirators. Oh yeah, that was from from the old one. Okay, so there's not a load load more, but there's a good amount more. And you've got a box of top tier parts there as well, but that takes 12 hours to produce. I just had a look and it's actually really not far for me to go and give this tier 2 key a try. So I'm going to send it and go for it. Yeah, I had some med stuff before, but I literally don't have any meds now. Okay, I think it's just here somewhere. Okay, it's 2.3 kilometers, so it's a little bit of a run. That's not too bad. I've only got a bandage. But let's go. Cover of darkness. Okay, yeah, I think just where they've marked on the map is wrong. I think it's going to be up at this commence military. This one here. Okay. Try and get in here and see if it's in this barrack, because I feel like this is where it's going to be. Ah, oh, there's the restart. Okay. Come on, let me in. Gotta be in here, isn't it? No, apparently not. Maybe in one of these rooms here. Another 3k there. Yeah, here you go. Found, found it. Quickly now. Okay, the box isn't there. We gotta do the runaway thing. At least I know where it is now. Two, three, four, five, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Let's go. Terrible crate, but I got filament and a gun. Take it, run. Okay, we got nails too. Nails aren't terrible. Got the AK-12 mags, which are pretty decent because they come with armor piercing rounds. Well, we got another filament anyway. That was a really good find, considering that we're going to be doing a lot of 3D printing. Okay, we are arriving back at base. Ah, <sighs> we're in. Safe at last. Well, I've got a few extra nails. I could get this finished right now, so I'm going to. Okay, build up a bank wall there. Very nice, very good. And uh, honestly, I think I'll just leave this open for now. Because, like, I can just close this, and then <laughs> I'm completely safe in this whole bit of the base. It's no big deal, really. Oh, what a hell of a run, though. I mean, that really was. Now, we can switch on this. Wait, let me put in my earplugs because it's hella loud. It close the tray. It's already got filament in. And we can print this one right here. Oh, it's two hours to produce this now? It never used to be that long. Okay. They've made 3D printing a little bit harder. It's probably good that it takes a bit longer, actually. Now, if I get one more cable reel and printer, then I can get another setup. There are four slots. 
in the, in the power generator there, as you can see, four different slots. So I can get four different cable reels and uh, four different 3D printers in that one to maximize it. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did get this far, please do give it a like and subscribe to catch episode two, which will be out Wednesday or Thursday. I'll see you guys then. Peace.